Just want to make a quick video to help people kind of diagnose themselves with Eagle Syndrome. What you need is a copy of a CAT scan that you've already had. This one was taken in 2009, so it's 2023 right now. This one's really old, just to show you that any old CAT scan will work. Then you got to download Radiant Viewer. You can find it online for free. They will. If you want, for $5 a month, you can use it as long as you want. In the free trial version, they're going to give you five minutes. And you can keep opening it over and over again, but it shuts down on you in five minutes. So it's a little frustrating. I did pay the $5 once, and it was really easy to cancel. So when you open it up, it has the countdown right here. And that's because I've already went through my five minutes. So when you reopen it again, it counts down 15 seconds. And we just click next. I'll go up here and do the CD button. Now it'll start downloading all your scans right here. Up top you have, I don't even know all these things. The ones I use is the 3D button, the scalpel, or the, I mean, that's the zoom, the pan image. Actually, once you hit 3D, they give you more options right here. You'll see in a second. So if you try to click on one that doesn't have many numbers by it, it's not gonna give you the 3D option because there's not enough images in order to show you in in 3d so I just gotta kind of wait a second so here's one now the 3d options open and there we go now you can see there's more tools here now so what you want to do is click on something and then you hold the left button down and you move your mouse Click on something else, left button. This picture actually isn't that good. I don't know, I only had half the head, maybe because I clicked it too fast. So now I'm gonna zoom in a little bit. Our problem during this time is mainly on my right side. The area you're gonna to try to get to is right there. This thing was in the way, so hit the scalpel button, cut it off. Everything has to do with just holding the mouse down and moving it around. Now you can see in there. Zoom in a little bit. Now you can see the end of the styloid right there going up. To really get a better view, you have to kind of rotate it so you can see behind the jawline. And this is why a lot of doctors, I don't think, diagnose you because on an x-ray it just disappears with all the other bone. But to even get a clearer look, what I like to do is turn the head, use the scalpel to get rid of the cheek, Delete inside. Now you can really see it right there. That's my eagle syndrome on the right side. Anyways, hope this video helps. You just have to play with this a little bit. I thought I'd make one on there so you could really see how to use this program. But you just have to ask for a copy of your CAT scan on CD and this program's free. So good luck.